Hello everyone, how's it going? Just taking out this quick video going over what is happening with the Oxygen stock. So Oxygen, this particular article came out yesterday from the Motley Fool Review. It's talking about how Oxygen could be a million making stock. One good thing about the article is it's trying to put down many of the bearish articles down. So let, let's get started. It's talking about how Oxygen is on the path to get the U EUA or the Emergency Use Authorization from the FDA. Now it's talking about a few good things. One, that it could be of more interest with the Department of Defense because it's easy to transport. It's highly effective and it's easy to store because it can be stored at a much higher temperature compared to the Pfizer and the Moderna vaccines. So that could kind of, I, I catch the interest from the Department of Defense. The second aspect was the Covaxin or the bio, Bharat Biotech's vaccine was tested and used the highly resistant this particular trade which was in India. So India has the highest or the, or the most notorious strain of COVID-19 and Bharat Biotech's Covaxin used that or it, it, it was very much successful in eradicating that. So Covaxin was able to prevent 100% of cases of severe diseases from the much more stronger variant. However, Pfizer and Moderna were developed before those mutations in COVID-19 were it had already come out. So that that's uh, one thing to look into. Uh, the the second aspect it's talking about how if it were to sell 100 million doses, then the assuming price target is of only $10 per dose. In India, it is selling it at 400 rupees, which is about five to six dollars if you convert. But even if you were to sell it at ten dollars here in the United States, and with the 45 percent partnership, it's talking about 100 and 135 million in pre-tax profits, where it thinks it's very good for a company with a market cap of 1.7 billion. But it's also giving one particular scenario where it, the U.S. population, the 18 plus U.S. population, has about or it has more majority of the people already been vaccinated. It's somewhere in the north of 60% have already been vaccinated. But you also need to think about the children in the lower end population, which also needs to be vaccinated. So yeah, uh, there's still some hope, but yeah, just to keep an eye for it, just to keep a look into it. Just wanna share this information with you. Take care, stay safe, bye-bye.